Atlanta gets a bad rap for being a motor city. It's traffic, traffic, and more traffic. Well, there's a place where you can walk, bike, run, shop, eat, and visit, all without filling up on gas first. What is an activity that is part outdoor exercise, part open air museum? You can bring the kid, you can bring your dog, and you get to go through great eclectic neighborhoods, check out restaurants and shops. Hmm, if only there were such a place. Hmm, I can find one. The Atlanta Beltline officially opened in 2008, but it's still a work in progress, covering 22 miles in one big loop, or belt, around Atlanta's downtown, connecting 45 of its diverse, historic, and hip neighborhoods. Joining everyone together and buckling us in to one big, happy Atlanta melting pot. On any given Sunday, or Saturday, or weekday for that matter, you can see walkers, joggers, bikers, skaters, cute kids and cute puppies, people strolling with strollers, and even sweet rides to borrow from the nearest six-year-old. Today we're exploring the East Side Trail, the first finished section of the Beltline, which runs from Piedmont Park to Inman Park and the Old Fourth Ward. Lemonade! Five cents for good advice. My advice is good, really. Anyone? Here you will find restaurants, businesses, shops, a skate park, and plenty of pit stops to enjoy the artwork. I'm calling this one burger and fries. Why am I suddenly hungry? No problem there. There's always pop stops, too. <laughs> and the Beltline has been a boon to local businesses. And what better business along a Beltline than a bike shop, which is perfect if you don't live in Atlanta, because you can park out and back, take your rental bike out the front. The amount of people walking past your business is, is huge. It's location, and right now in the city of Atlanta, this is the best location that you can get. The Bell Line has brought us a nice rental business. Uh, we rent bikes, uh, and people can take them anywhere they want to. To me, you know, the bicycle is, is transportation. The Bell Line is the place to be as far as uh, riding bikes. And then right next door is Civil Bikes, which provides historic tours of the Bell Line. Check out the great views of Atlanta's skyline and appreciate Atlanta's old architecture, like the historic Sears building. And you can bike by Atlanta history. It's now a shopping center, but this area used to be the Atlanta Crackers baseball field. Also, you will notice the coolest thing. It is the Beltline Arboretum Trees Atlanta project. And my favorite feature, art on the Beltline, with Atlanta's largest public arts project, spread out along eight curated miles, with bike themes, of course. And these guys made out of old pieces of the railroad. And that brings us to the best part. The Atlanta Beltline is more than just the most awesome sidewalk ever. While the sidewalk may be new, the Beltline has a history that goes back more than 100 years. Well, it was an operating railroad, of course. And in the old days, in the 20s, when the Sears building was originally built, the railroad actually pulled into the building. A uh, warning, low clearance, canopy will not clear, man on top or side of car, which is pretty amazing. It's kind of scary, that's yeah. a real, yeah. yeah. The Beltline follows the path of Atlanta's original railroad, and today you can still see some of those original rails, preserved as bits of transportation history. And here's where it gets even cooler. This incredible piece of Atlanta all started with a grad student's thesis project back in 1999, seriously. Well, I started college at Georgia Tech in 1991, on, lived on the West Campus, and was sort of fascinated with the gritty industrial side of the city, and would, would drive around following the old railroads all the way through the city, following maps. And that land is really unique to have this loop formation around downtown, so that was, became the sort of compelling idea for the project. From there, Ryan was inspired by the High Line in New York's Chelsea neighborhood, also an old railway turned into a public park. Many years later, and with grants and contributions, the Atlanta Belt Line is now one of the largest urban redevelopment programs currently underway in the entire country. But it's a whole lot more. 
during the week, we're all in our cars. Atlanta's known for their traffic. You go from your house to your car to your office. On the weekends, if you're out on the Beltline, you're like, oh, here's all the people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and that's kind of the idea. Right. Well, and it happens every day, too. It's where we live our lives. This is where we meet each other and fall in love and raise our families. And so the idea with the Beltline is to build a more life-affirming infrastructure that actually changes the way that we live. <laughs> It still just tickles me to no end to see how much it's used. It's become like Atlanta's boardwalk. And you never know who you might meet on the Beltline. Chantel Ritter is an artist who once worked on Mardi Gras parades. When she moved to Atlanta, she brought that funky New Orleans vibe along with her. I think that the way New Orleans has such a strong cultural identity comes from that. They love their physical space. They love their city streets. They're very, very proud of their culture and their place. I think that has everything to do with the fact that they inhabit it so frequently. When she noticed that Atlantans don't inhabit their own streets that frequently, she thought a parade on the Beltline would be just the trick. Well, I believe that creative events based in participation foster enduring bonds between people and place. So laying down joyful shared memories together, I thought would um, help make everybody love it. And it did. The Atlanta Beltline Lantern Parade started in 2010 and has grown every year with tens of thousands of participants and neighbors coming together. And that's really the best part of the Beltline. In a world where we're always staring at our phones, computers, in our cars, offices, and homes, the Atlanta Beltline gets us out to meet new friends. Oh, look, don't we twirl? We twirl, we see and be seen. We're so fabulous. Am I twirling correctly? Yes. I have to get my, my Beltline twirling down. <laughs>